Today is November 12th, and this is your One Minute News. Minneapolis Chief of Police begged the city council to bring in help, saying our city is bleeding at the moment and I'm trying everything I can do to stop the bleeding. Senator Bernie Sanders says he would like to be Secretary of Labor for Joe Biden. Joe Biden's COVID chief says we should go back into lockdown for four to six weeks to avoid virus hell. And the government can borrow money to pay people during the lockdown because nothing builds the economy more than printing money. Ticketmaster plans to require a negative COVID test or proof of vaccine to attend the ve- events. So anti-vaxxers can no longer go to concerts. China condemns defiant pro-democracy lawmakers in Hong Kong, saying it's an open challenge to its authority. That is what fascism looks like again. Turkmenistan's president has bestowed his favorite dog breed with the highest honor of an incredibly large golden statue in the middle of town square. And that made the news. Women with the name Karen have seen a 31% drop in dating app interest, says Wingman. (laughs) My heart goes out to Karens all across the world. Tucker Carlson goes over many names of dead people that actually have voted in this election. And many in the media, like New York Times, prestigious New York Times, claim there is no voter fraud anywhere. Hmm. And today in history, in 1954, Ellis Island shuts its doors after processing 12 million immigrants Opening in 1892, have you been to New York and seen Ellis Island? I have never even been to New York. (laughs) Am I missing anything? Maybe not with this COVID. Hope you guys have a fantastic Thursday. Guys, if you don't mind sharing this video, sharing this podcast, however you want, via word of mouth or on any social media platform, it would mean so much to me. You can copy and paste any link you want. Uh, uh, I see people doing that all the time, and it honestly means a lot to me because I know that's the only way we will grow as a community. The only way I will grow as a podcast is uh, if you guys share, and I appreciate you guys doing it because the algorithms do not support independent people like me. They just don't care. I don't have the money to you know, put up every single show and sponsor it and all that stuff. So I appreciate all the people that do that. It means a lot to me. I see you guys doing that. Thank you. Also, Get your bonus questions into me for the Friday bonus edition, the week recap show, whatever you want to call it. You can email me at the one minute news at gmail.com or you can DM me on any social media platform. I'd be happy to answer any question you have throughout the week. I don't even have to say your name if you feel uncomfortable doing this. You can feel free to ask whatever you want. Uh, we can talk about, you know, culture, politics, what's going on in the world religion. I don't care. Whatever you want to talk about. Dating. (laughs) I don't care. I hope you guys have a fantastic Thursday. I'll see you tomorrow morning for another edition of the One Minute News.